I don't know who's watching. I don't care who's watching. I'm coming for that card in November. They said top two gets overall, but I'm, I might be top two, but I'm not two. <laughs> <laughs>see what you're working with that's nuts that's nuts so how long you been training for uh, nine, years, nine years okay that's what's up i know we have to talk about it you know the difference between natural and enhanced yep. what was what would you say will be the biggest difference when he went on the enhanced side of Shoulder, things shoulders. your shoulders yeah. yeah what about eating like you able to intake a lot more than usual or is it just really like primarily towards growth type of thing depends what you're running. Right, okay. I mean, overall, I say yeah, you know. Gotcha, gotcha, yeah. That's, that was always my issue, just gaining lean, lean mass. Yeah. Actually, just weight in general. It, I could, I could yeah. lose five pounds in a night sleeping, but to put it back on. Exactly. Uh, come down from 10 right here, come on. 10. Uh, Nine. Uh, eight. Ooh, come on. Seven. Ooh. Three. Two. Uh, one. Uh, yep. Hit that part. Come on. Pump it. Uh, yep. Yep. Oh, uh, fuck. There you go. Nice. Yeah. This is too steep.
One of few things I need to invest in is some good wrist wraps. If you guys are ever shoulder pressing with dumbbells, the reason that a lot of you are getting injured is because you don't have that stabilization in your wrist. I don't go heavy with a lot of things I do unless it's a leg day, but you would never see me like squatting 405 or 10 reps and stuff because I would rather not get injured. Like I'm still young, you know what I mean? So I'm trying to protect my joints as much as possible. I like lifting heavy, but especially in prep, it's only to a certain degree, only to a certain degree. I got you. Let me run a couple cycles, please. <laughs> Coach, if you're watching this, <laughs> it's too late. No, I'm playing. <laughs> I'm still young, so I want to get the most out of I can. But if I'm being completely honest, just me being in prep, like simultaneously, this is like about to be the fourth show I entered. By the end of this year, will be show number five. I don't want to keep putting my body through this. You know what I mean? So it's just, it's going to have to be a, a really hard decision to either like walk away or grow you know what i mean yeah yeah it's like i love the habits and routines that i'm able to build while being in prep uh because i just locked the fuck in This is already pumped. Oh, already pumped. That's all we gotta do right there. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I was like, we could do chest press, but my chest is already solid right now. With that being said, we're about to move into triceps and biceps. It's gonna be pretty quick, nothing too crazy. We'll probably do a total of two tricep exercises and maybe two to three bicep exercises. So I really want to end it off with preacher curls once we get done um, doing like, you know, you wanna, uh, bicep curls or something like that. Bicep, tricep. Tricep, bicep, back Let's do two tricep right away. Two and then two. Yeah, right, right away, yeah.
Yep. Let's do it. Yep. Preacher. Back. Yep. Let's do it. Jesus. One hell of a workout, my guy. One hell of a workout. Sure. Thank you guys for tuning into the YouTube video. I hope you enjoyed this workout. Try it for yourselves because the pump is actually insane. But if you guys haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And we're officially seven weeks out. And before you know it, show day's here. I'll catch you guys in the next YouTube video. Peace.